Good morning. We're discussing generosity and kindness. And in his most recent book, Ways to Go Beyond and Why They Work, by the British biologist Rupert Sheldrake, he has a whole section in his last chapter on kindness. And he says that in the animal world, cooperation and helping others is built into us as part of being a social animal. And that um, the, the Christian language, theological language of a loving father, a loving mother, Jesus is a prototype of kindness. All this is built into the notion of kinship and kindness. But he says in 19th century Europe, egotism came to eclipse kindness as a social norm, at least for men. In a world of competitive individualism, kindness was a sign of weakness. And it was only clergymen, charity workers, and above all women who were considered to be uh, part of a world of kindness. Kindness, he says, was feminized. But in fact, he points out that our survival depends on kindness. This is how important the sense of kinship and generosity is.